As of today, COVID-19 restrictions are officially rolling back in Minnesota. That means that you can eat inside restaurants and swim in public pools. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield shows us how the changes came at a crucial time for some businesses. As of late, the St. Louis Park restaurant has been grab and go only, but that was never the plan. We're in the hospitality business. Our dream is to have people in the restaurant. So we want to be safe, we want to be careful, but we are operating at 50%. As of Monday morning, that dream was once again reality at Yum Kitchen and Bakery. Are you guys going to eat here? Woo! We love you for that. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're so excited to have you. Masks were on, tables sanitized, and furniture spaced, which was enough comfort for Sarah Joe to dine in. I'm so excited. I feel like we're back, to, not back to normal, but I can breathe again. I need to be able to eat at restaurants. I'm sick of being cooped up. Maria's in South Minneapolis was also greeted with enthusiastic regulars. You can see today they right away start coming. People also started hitting the water in Nisswa, Minnesota, after pool and hot tub restrictions were lifted. Our pools opened at 9 o'clock this morning. At 9.03, we had our first family in the pool. Because Grandview is a family resort and amenities are key, they've lost nearly a million dollars in business since the November shutdown. But they are open again. It was a huge relief. Uh, we were right on the edge of having to lay off a bunch of employees. Bookings are already way up. And in the hospitality business, more reservations mean fewer worries. You're ready to have a full resort again? Well, the Grandview says that reservations are already up so much that instead of laying off staff, they now need to hire more staff.